And like from day one when I came in, I just, uh, my mindset was I'm going to give everything to this team and to this city uh, to try to win a championship here because I knew uh, these guys have already been so close. And, um, and yeah, and once I got hurt, it was a heartbreaking moment for me. I didn't even like, want to accept the truth like you know it was kind of like no like no way it happened right but um yeah tonight was the night i was like listen i'm gonna give everything i have and uh and yeah i'm just super happy to be a part of this and 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 to give something to the team and man i'm super thankful for the support i've gotten from the from the fans and and tonight the arena was was electric and it's uh, yeah, it's 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 been unbelievable to play in front of these fans. Tim, standing on the left. Chris Stops. What what was sort of the process today in particular of getting yourself on the court, and sort of when did you realize or decide that you were going to make sure you were out there today? Uh, you know what? Like <laughs> since last game, I w- I've been thinking about like how can I pre- get my body ready for next game? Like no matter how it is. And uh, and today I was like, I'm gonna try to everything possible to to get out there. Uh, so from this morning I was preparing myself that I will go out there. Like, and um, and yeah, uh, the medical staff was was like unbelievable support for me and and got me back out there somehow. And man, I'm super thankful for them. And uh, yeah. I gave everything I could. I gave everything I could, and, and man, it feels it feels it feels great to be a champion. Standing on your right, Chris Stapps over here. Wall, other steps. Yes. Um, the reputation of this team is that it scores, shoots, spreads the floor. You could make the argument though that you won this series with defense and toughness. Can you talk about toughness? And you know, obviously, you watched a lot of games here the last couple of months on the on the bench. Can you talk about how toughness really mattered? Yeah, we have like a <clears throat> we have a super like composed team. We don't have any like loud like guys and like we're super confident but also like down to earth um people in this organization and, and in this roster. And uh and man, we we were gonna everybody had the mindset of like we, we're going to do whatever it takes, each of us individually, to get the job done. Like We want to win a championship for this city. Back right, and, Adam. And everything, you know, we did everything possible for that. And now we, have, we, we, we get the fruits from our labor. Back right, Adam. Uh, throughout this whole, this whole year with us, it seems like with you guys too, Joe is always focused on don't look past the next day, don't look past the next day. I was curious now that kind of there is no next day, how he reacted, and just your thoughts on his general, um, you know, the job he did with this team, getting them to this point. There is no what? No next day, like. Next day? Yeah, like, it's over, uh, you guys won champ. Right. Yeah, finally, finally, man. <sighs> like, it was a long road to get here, to be honest, you know, and to be the last team standing, it feels, it feels amazing, like all that work paid off. Uh, when, uh, as I said, like when I was still on the stage and stuff, like it still felt surreal. Like I couldn't, and and us as a team, I think we couldn't really, like, settle into that. Uh, but when, then, when, once we got back to the locker room and started celebrating, I think that's when everybody realized, like, yo, we actually did it. We did it, and um, and uh, and yeah, and, and Joe's a Joe's an animal. In the front and center. Kristaps, all year you guys have talked about the importance of Al and how much he means to you guys. What was it like to see him finally raise that trophy? Yeah, no, uh, great question. Al's, a, Al's an unbelievable teammate, unbelievable person. Uh, everybody loves him. He's a great leader. And, uh, <laughs> and, you know, knowing how he has been chasing this for so long in his career and finally get it done and, and, and playing at a high, high level at his age, uh, man, he's... he's I don't, I don't even know what like words I can use to describe him. You know, everybody loves him, and 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 he gave everything to this team, and and uh, he deserves it more than anybody. John, third row on the right. Chris stops now. Now that it's over, can you be honest about how bad the injury was? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, obviously, uh, like what was put out, it, it was the truth. You know, it was uh, it was like a something torn, and then the, the my tendon is just out of place. 
and and it like pretty much hurts on every step. Like I would take a walk in Dallas and my leg would swell up. Like so I was like, I don't know how I'm gonna play if I'm gonna play. But my mindset was always like I'm gonna try to find a way how I can manage this and and uh, and yeah somehow I got it going for this game and. Uh, a lot of it was for sure like the adrenaline from just playing at the garden and playing in front of our fans and 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 having that opportunity to to close it out and uh and man i got it going last one front left here chris Depps, i'm sure you've played this moment over in your head a hundred times thousand times in your life how is this moment different from what you were anticipating good question I, I don't know how to answer it yet to be honest i think i'm gonna need a little bit of time and then i can kind of reflect um, cause right now I'm just so in the moment and, and enjoying this, um, man, this, this, this team, like, you know, it's, it's, it's just a special team and like everybody gave whatever they could for us to get here. And, uh, and right now we're just so in the moment. And I think.